Oh. Oh, we're going to have to escape from that one. Welcome to Tall V Small. We're escaping from many, many different lies today. Yes, some good ones and some bad ones, but mostly bad ones. Yeah. Um, yeah. We would have hit them there before because, you know. That's what happens. And, Let's and go. Always hit great shots. No, so. let's go. Tall V Small. <laughs> Okay, right, so shot number one is a low one under the trees. We've got about, what you reckon, 65 yards in there, 70 yards? Yeah. What are you playing? I've got a five. Yeah, I thought you might. <laughs> We've already had this discussion that I don't have a five iron at the moment, as it has no grip on it. I won't be using five. I reckon I'll be using six. Yeah, little hooded runner. Hooded runner. Like a youth running away from the police. Oh, is it gonna get there? She's bumbling on the front edge. Yep, that's good. She'll do. She will do. Very much be a three from there. You don't want too good a lie, but also you don't want it to, don't want to, don't want to be sat up. So guys, this is great if you're just testing your skills. Yep. Because I don't know about you, but I've definitely hit it into situations like this before. Yeah, most holes. I haven't hit any shots today though, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. So we can see where we're going. No elevation at all. So we're out, just need a little bit more up. Right, let's get up there and see where they are. Okay guys, so we've got up here and Simon's just got it, well, about sort of 15 yards short of the front edge. I've managed to somehow scab it onto the front. Bumbled up there nicely. Nice little new 64 degree wedge in action now. Pitched it up on there. Ooh, stopped pretty sharp. It's just rolled out a little. Putt, Not too bad. He's got a putt, which means he's got a chance because the boy can putt. Okay, so coming up onto the green, Adam is to putt first. I'm just going to aim point this up. This is to win the hole. Oh, he's whacked it. He's whacked it. He has whacked it. Do you want to finish? Oh, he's going to finish. Oh yes, well done, good, thought for a second that might have just snuck away from you there. I thought, oh, I've said I'll finish and then I didn't. Okay, no, so he's going a little bit of break on it, we'll see how much in just a few moments. Only two from the right. A decent amount of swing. Straight downhill though. So it will be fairly brisk. Tracking. Oh, turning a bit too much. Had a go though. Had to have a go at it. That's quick today, aren't they? Right, one nil. One up. Let's go. Okay, right, so hole number two is 105 yards. And you can just kind of zoom with the speediest zoom in the world with this camera up into the flag there you can see so over some trees over a bunker to a pin 105 yards what club you got, got 52. 52 so you can just about see the top of the trees up there i'm going to move back just a little so you can get some of these trees in as well Got over the trees nicely. Has it reached? Oh yeah. Oh, just carried the bunker, but not reached the green. That's, that's still a very good effort. 
You'd be happy with the direction, yeah, yeah, you'd be happy with everything on that. Good. Right, so there's your divot, so let's get in here next to that. It's hard to hit it that high and that far. And still hit it, yeah, exactly. So Simon has the, the advantage here, because he's now got 56, and I would say it's more of a normal shot for him from here. It was a bit fiddly with 52 for me. You took me up then. Yeah. Oh, that set off on a great line. Just left of the flag. Oh, he's pitched it pin high. The boy. I'm coming back. I want Celebrations. The world to know. Got to let it show. Chipping would burst the bubble. <laughs> Okay, so coming up onto the green, I've hit it in just in here quite nicely. Adam's got himself a little chip to this flag. I will go and repair my pitch mark in a second. You got 52 again? Yep. So you can see from the flag, it's a little windy day today. English conditions. So let's just run on a little bite. Let's have a go for it though, because I'm going to hold mine in a second. Up onto the green now. Adam hasn't lost his turn. That's a lovely cut. Is it going to drop? Ooh. Yeah, that's that over and done with. Mm. Definitely. The chip was not good enough. One of those, isn't it? It's, all, it's like, like my second shot and first shot on the last hole. Before you know it, you're out of it, aren't you? Yeah. It's not a very good chip. There we go. Dorano. Right, all square. Onward. Okay, guys, so hole number three is. The green is just bomb. down there, so we're going to get a nice low cut, or you can go wider, but you're going to have to cut it even more. See, so if you go. Oh, you go like through here, it's gonna have to cut a lot more, but you don't have to keep it quite as low. Or we can go down at the inside of the trap here, but you're gonna have to not cut it quite as much, but you're gonna have to keep it very low. Or you can just hit it left of the bunker with an arm. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. So we're going, Simon's going left of the trap and with a bit more swerve. Or swavager. What club have you got? I have seven iron. Seven iron, and we're about one. 65-ish. Yeah, yeah. Isn't quite a full one, but it will be fairly full with this distance. Oh, not enough curve. Not enough curve? Bunker. Just left Get it to the, the... Get in the bunker. In the bunker? Yeah, we're in the bunker. In the trap. Be okay. Fine. What club would you like, sir? Um, five, please. Five? No prizes for guessing where we started from, as my divot will tell you everything you need to know. Well, I'll tell you where the starting tee box was, it won't tell you anything about face or path, will it? Meh. We're being we're being attacked, we are being attacked. We have nearly been killed. There is a ball just landed there. Okay, we're back. We will Endeavour to hit these before we die. Although if we do die, at least it's on camera. Yeah. Should get the views going.
Cut it nicely. Yeah. Oh, yes. So, yeah, 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 running up there. So, I'm going to the world's fastest zoom. Middle of the green. Middle of the green. Look at that. Okay, so up and down and crush some dreams, I say. Okay, so you get down here. It's just in the back of this bunker. Yes. So, be fairly aggressive with this bunker shot. Nice sort of back stop behind it. Yeah. Simon is very good out of the sand, so I expect this to be fairly adjacent. With a new wedge, the new 64 in hand. Mm. Oh yes, that is the only issue with the 64. If I catch it a little bit heavy, there's just nothing there. There's a lot of loft. When you catch it heavy, it's tough. Mm. It's one of those length bunker shots where you potentially should have played that with 56, maybe. I'm just going to repair this person's bitch marking. We are recording. That wasn't our pitch mark, this, but just one second. I'm just doing me, doing me a bit for mankind. Not the WWE wrestler mankind. Right, so Adam is putting up. I'm going to leave the flag in. So you can see exactly what we've got occurring. So for his two. And to make my putt null and void. What are you seeing? Uphill, obviously. Yeah. Okay, so you're seeing a little bit left to right, so we're coming from this sort of line here, I imagine. It's all about the pace. Ooh, that's a good part. Got it. Got it. No, oh, don't do that. <laughs> Kapow, look at that face. Yeah, only, a face only a mother could love. My mother does. And that's a good thing. Right, so no boring halves in this game, just birdies galore. Right, on to the next. It is 190 yards. It's long. What have you got? Four iron? I have. Swang! The people on that third tee box are in. <laughs> Third tee box? Crikey, second tee box. People on the third tee box are 450 yards away. Although there is a buggy behind the behind our green we're playing to, so. Sorry, I'm just trying to get the... No, you have already mentioned that you don't like hooking balls. Ah, as prescribed, Adam, as prescribed, just before he played this shot, he said he was going to leave it out to the right, and you can just about, with the powers of the speediest zoom in the world, just down in that area there, just, just by of, those, just short of the trap, just by those yeah. little stakies. Oh, I do not like this shot. Not easy, is it? I'm going to go back to my bag and grab my glove for this one. Ironically, I don't know why, I'm just fancy me glove on for this shot. Fancy your glove on for this one. Didn't need it for the hook, but I'm going to go for it with this one. And for the fade. So you happy with turning it this way? In principle, yes. In reality, who knows? There's not a lot of room from where we were before. There is no, there's definitely, this is definitely a harder shot than the last one we were playing. Right. Too much, miles too much. Yes. So if I just pan in here, Simon has gone sort of in, just in there. I wasn't leaving that one out to the right. Wow, really close now. <laughs> See what's going on. Okay, so we've got down here and 
I'm in the long grass. So not only one escape, but two escapes this time round. A few stingers. A little tree issue. Loft isn't a problem though. Plenty of that. It's whether I can get enough forward momentum to... Excavate it from this lie. Green cubes have stopped. Another spectator, lovely. No, he hasn't stopped. Has he stopped? No. Now he's stopped. Oh. That came out a bit of a... It came out a bit sideways, that one. Bit of a bit of an angle. It's a strange one. Mm. Okay, so, I've kind of hit two pretty poor shots, really, an overhook and a shank. For, for the want of a better word, there is no better word for it, that is a hosel rocket. He's got grass just got tangled up. So Trey's gone back to hit his pitch into the green. I'm hoping for not a very good one, if I'm honest. I could do with this hole being halved in four and moving on to the next. Well, he's playing well at the moment, though. He's hit that. Are you OK? OK, it's running on a little. But, um... I'll tell you what, there could be a right old flip reversal if I bin mine. Ooh, hoo, 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 look out! OK, so if this putt goes in... Look out, is all I have to say. All I have to say is look out. Not much in this part at all. Okay, guys, so someone's got a bit of a long putt from here. So I've picked up this golf ball on the way out, and it's not one of the ones I'd normally use. And I'll say a full shot, it's absolutely fine. If any short game shots, it feels like it comes off like a bouncy ball. So it's coming off really quick. That's something I'd say to anybody trying to pick a golf ball, chip and putt with it first, see what it feels like. Right, see if he can hold this. Oh, it looks on a good line. Maybe a fraction shy. The old left foot give. It's healed that a bit. Yeah. Twisted it left. It didn't start far enough right, but... That's the left foot give. Oh, I haven't got my left foot there, but, you know. And Bit of a straddle. <laughs> right. This for glory. Glory B. Not easy to hold putts of this sort of distance. But, as we've already shown, Trester can putt. Apologise, got some hiccups in my old face at the moment. Well, I guess he's seeing this left to right, I imagine. It's a great putt. No, oh, well played. Two up. Oh no! Stop it. All right, is there any way back? We shall find out. Yeah. Try not to fat. Try not to fat is the call. No, no, not an easy shot. This. Played it well. Is she coming? Oh, she zipped back nicely. Yeah, that's a great shot. You can be happy with that, yeah? Yeah. Oh, you've run the other risk of, it's like a knife. Or 
perfect. So this shot for me guys isn't isn't very nice. Like, I don't like any fuller shots out of sand if I'm honest. So I've been practicing these a little bit. Because ultimately I might get a few. 56 for Simon. More sort of a punchy way. It's a little heavy, wasn't it? A little heavy. It's got there. So. Yeah. Two straight putts coming up. Yes. He'll probably hold this one. Always break the bunker. With two hands, two handed job. Leave it how you would want to find it. Okay, so we're going to putt with the flag in just because you know you can't do two jobs at once. So you can just about see that this one is pretty much, I would say, well Simon will tell us in a minute, I had the putt from just over here a minute ago, so I was in here somewhere, and that was pretty straight across there. We've had this putt already, haven't we? Much turning this. It's a little bit right to left at the end, I think. Just a smidgen from right to left at the end. Zoom in, I'm the quickest to zoom in the world. Zoom past me as I hit it. About there, I reckon. Oh, I hit it. Oh! Left foot give. Okay, so that was pretty close. Annoying. I was hoping to get one back there. Yeah, you've had this putt as well. He was a little further round to the left last time we had this putt. So is it going to turn as much? And quite a lot at the end last time. That's good. Oh, is it? I hit something on route. Unlucky. Yes. Right, OK. We need another decider. We don't really, I'm too down, but try and find another excuse to keep the game going. So as is traditional with us, we have finished the challenge with the most ridiculous shot we could find. What you got? I don't even know how I'm going to blow it. What club have you got? I've got six iron. Okay. And that'll keep it that low. I've got to turn it and fly four trees. Yeah. Apart from that, and it's out of... Some some cuckoo, you grass. Right. Try and keep it fairly low. Try and turn it. And really just hope for the best. Oh, it's missed the tree. Oh, oh it's on. It's just rolling off the back edge. I think it's just gone off the back edge, but that's a pretty good effort, to yeah. be honest. I'm pretty, yeah, that's very good. Aim for the trees, they're 90% air, so people keep telling me. Yeah, they do say that, don't they? 90% air, not normally when I hit it, though. I'm going to utilise your same theory of 90% air, yeah. but in a slightly different way. That seems to be a 56 degree wedge. You've got to get back in this cuckoo so you want to try and go up through that tree, I'd imagine. Yeah, I'm, well, yeah, I'm, see, I'm going in the kind of the same gap you were going in, but slightly higher. So, no, I don't know how far we got. Oh, fair distance, 90 odd yards. Oh, the 90% air rule has applied. Oh, Where's that gone? Front, Front bunker. Front bunker. To be he's fair, went through this tree just about there and then he took off one or two leaves. So he's done well there, the boy. I don't know where my divot's gone. It's just there, so just in, just in front of you. Oh, it's all still in there. It was a tree that fell over, not me divot. Right, let's get up there. Okay, so we get up here just into that front trap. So we've come from down there into here. Mm. That is a horrible pin placement from the fairway though, isn't it? Back that is left, that's perched tough. out there. That is tough. 
So right. 64 degree wedge out of the trap. A bit more speed than last time I played this on the 12. Yeah, more speed than the 12 hole. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Just run out a little bit, but a good shot. It could be much more aggressive with this 50, uh, 64 than my old wedge, definitely. Yeah. It's interesting how much of a difference that four degrees makes. So, mm. see where yours has ended up. Okay, so played two shots into here. Adam's actually okay. He's just in the f sort of second fringe, as it were. Yeah, well, we can see it, which is always a bonus. It's fine seeing a golf ball is a good start when you're not on the fairway. It was taking a bit of a bounce off to the right. Pretty good, though. Pretty good. Yes. Not bad. I've played better. <laughs> I've also played a lot worse. Yeah. That's really this roundabout. Challenge. Okay. So I'm just trying to take my glove off at the same time. So where have you got this set? Left to right. Just off the right. Not a lot by that indication. Willy hole out. Ooh. I have that one. Not bad. You can have that. So, for the Harfingtons, oh, I've got a long way away, let me get a bit closer so you can see that a little better. How you seeing it? Just outside the hole, I'm guessing right edge. Yep, good putt, well done. Well played, sir, very Thank good. Thank you all. Well done. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. It's a little bit different again. So, does adventures in the escapes. Does that mean that I hit it in more random places? You're better at getting it out of the random place. We'd be good at foursomes, I think. Uh, yeah. I put you in the rubbish, you put me out, and I hold the putt. <laughs> done. Although you hold all the putts today. It's good, isn't it? Mm, yeah. That Adele fitting yesterday. Yes. Aim point is definitely like working, isn't it? Yeah, yeah definitely. For 100%. me, love it. Great process. Yeah. Frees you up, doesn't it? Frees yes. your mind I up. I like the whole shame at that point let it go done. And, yeah and more often than not it's right isn't yep, it yeah definitely good so guys as always thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed that guys if you've liked this and want to see some more then hit the subscribe button in the middle that'll get you all of our content as we upload it plus you'll get little notifications yeah each time it goes live before before we've even released it to everybody else. I know, it's nice, isn't it? So yeah, we obviously we do a lot of live stuff, so make sure you do subscribe yeah. so you do get that notification as soon as we go live. And we'll see you very soon. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.